In this video, we're going to be talking 30 day challenges and how you can decide on the best 30 day challenge for you with some helpful top tips from our 30 day challenge queen, Hetty herself. And we're going to be showing you what our 30 day challenge is going to be for the next 30 days throughout July, which you can watch and enjoy. Hi everyone! Hey! Welcome to our safe space lockdown session where we create a safe space to explore the big issues of life mm -hmm. and faith. And so today I've been I've been looking at YouTube and people seem to be doing these 30 day challenges. Mm -hmm. And it got me thinking, um, has anyone have anyone ever tried a 30 day challenge? Maybe drop us a comment, yes or no, if you have or, or haven't. Or if you would like to think about doing one, maybe you could say, I'd like to do one. Mm. Well, if that is the case, we're going to talk about 30 day challenges because yeah. Hetty here is the self motivation queen of the two of us. Um, mm. And she is going to talk about some of your top tips. Yeah, I've done quite a lot. You have? I've done quite a lot of 30 day challenges. Mm. It's not hard to keep some up for 30 days, it is for longer. Um, yeah. However, I have failed quite a few of them as well, right. which means that I've got a lot of experience uh, in the matter. You know, you yeah, learn things yeah, by yeah. failing as well yeah. as succeeding. Mm. So uh, we're going to talk about that later. Okay, well more about in a bit, but first we have some... Uh, shout outs. Shout outs, that's the word I'm looking for. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. First we have some shout outs. Yes, yeah, so shout out again, hi to Olivia. Olivia! Olivia is so keen on Instagram, just like liking everything, nice one. Um, and Connor, hi Connor. Connor! Connor's been commenting this week and liking everything really quick, which is awesome. We love yeah, people like that. Yeah. We love people that like and comment, it makes us feel like, yeah, yeah people are yeah. listening. Yeah. If you like that as well, why don't you like this video? Like. Mm. Or drop a comment, or do you go over to Instagram and check out what we're doing on there, because we'll be talking about that as part of our 30-day challenge spiel. Before we get there though, we always like to have a bit of a question Ooh. that's just a little bit of, bit of extra flavouring in there from our rooted pack of cards. Our rooted question is one that we asked a few videos ago, which is, what do you love about where you live? Mm. Now, our question for you this week though is, if you could rate that question as a question in easiness, what would you score it? Ooh. Zero to ten. Maybe you could drop your zero to 10 in the comments on the video. Let us know what you think. How easy a question is it to answer? What do you love about where you live? Maybe you're someone who absolutely adores where you live and you're like, oh, I, I could just go on forever and ever. It's so easy. And that's a 10. Or maybe you're someone who's like, oh, well, I'm gonna have to scratch my head for the next million, billion years. Yeah, trying to think oh, you'd wear your head away, wouldn't you? Yeah. Yeah. Mm, be a bit, yeah. bit boring as yeah. well. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Don't do that. Well, that could be a zero. But yeah, what do you love about where you live? Drop an answer in the comments. So we've seen loads of 30 day challenges lately um, and there's so many. How do you know what to do, what to choose and how to go about it? So um, here's a few things that other people have been doing. Have a look. Some of the things we've seen people doing but how do you choose the best thing for you to do as a 30-day challenge and how do you go about it how do you make the most of that 30-day challenge hetty well i thought maybe we should give you five top tips here we go here's the five tips it's what you've been waiting for tip number one is work out your what and your why your what and your why yeah if you don't know what you're gonna do, you, I guess you won't you do, do anything. You wouldn't do anything, no. would you? No. Which is pretty rubbish hmm. challenge. 
Yeah. But your why, uh -huh. that's that's quite important. That's a, that is a, that's a good tip because actually if you don't have any motivation in what you're doing, then you, you're just not going to achieve it, are you? No. 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 Like some people really want to do some sort of physical challenge and their why is because they're unfit. Okay. And so yeah. actually yeah. they want to be able to get up the stairs without being out of breath or yeah. You know, be able to run around with someone or, or play a sport they used to be able to play and now they can't. Yeah. Or someone might want to improve their, their mental well being and sort yeah. of do something that's good for them emotionally every yeah. day in the 30 days. Or they might have made a new friend that speaks another language oh. and they're like, oh, I'm going to learn this new language because I want to communicate with my friend better. Yeah. Why do you want to communicate with your friend better? To show that I really appreciate them yeah. and that they're welcome to be my friend. And yeah, okay. Exactly. I like that. That's, that's your why. Not bad. Mm. So, what motivates you? I wonder. Why don't you slip your answer in the comments right now? What motivates you? Tip number two is make it doable. Because if it's something you can't actually do, then you're just not going to... You've got to be realistic, exactly. haven't you? You've got to yeah. be realistic. So, for me, to say I'm going to run 30 miles a day, just not doable and no. um, actually for me to run any miles a day it's not overly doable you're not into um, running are you not at the moment no. i have been but i injured myself last oh. summer and i'm still a bit wary of my ankle i'm trying to be careful so for me it's doable to do an hour of physical activity every day yeah. as long as i'm not overdoing it every day and hurting myself as mm -hmm. long as i walk some of the days yeah. or uh, I really like doing um, an online class, right, with this barbell, and you hold this like bar with weights on, and yeah. you kind of go, ooh, ooh, and it's like music, and you pull it up and down, and then you like lift it in the air and stuff, um, not too much, or you might like hurt yourself. It's not um, quite my cup of tea. It's or, not, or, but I enjoy I, it. I could do a, a plank challenge, so I could. I could plank for a minute because yeah, a minute every day because actually if you see a video from a couple of weeks ago i managed to plank for even longer than that i, was, I, amazed. I was really impressed i, I did not I mean, expect uh, i'd be able to do oh yeah i knew you'd be able to do it Tip number three! The more specific, the better. Uh, okay, being specific. Yeah. Speci I can't say. I can specific. never say. Spe specific. Spe specific. Um, <coughs> Spe <coughs> so if you were going to read a book, you yeah. kind of need to know which book you're going to read. But also you need to decide maybe how much of the book you're going to read every day. True. Because yeah. if you're just going to decide which book it is, you could just pick up the book and be like, oh, the title of this book is The Philosopher's Stone. And then put it down again. And then pick it up the next day and be like, oh, the title yeah, of this book is The Philosopher's Stone. Yeah, that's a bit boring, isn't it? And, and, and you, yeah. yeah, don't do that. That's don't not, do speci that. not no. specific. Specific. Spe spe specific. Yeah. Or maybe if you're going to try something a bit more like deep and, deep and personal, maybe like praying for 30 days uh -huh. or something, to maybe if you were a Christian praying specifically to help your relationship with Jesus to grow closer yeah. or maybe if you express faith in a different way to that it might be praying for a particular situation yeah, every true. day um, or, or a particular person every day or yeah. something like that that would help mm. sounds good tip number four is celebrate when you've achieved it. yes I love celebrating, especially if it involves food uh -huh. or drink or something like that. Like yeah. just to really, you know, let your hair down and just enjoy the fact I have achieved. Yeah. You should have like a, a proper bottle of Coke. Yeah. And like a proper nice meal that you really want. Yeah. You know, Depends. like the curry we talked about last uh, week. Uh, we all the that. full fat cokes. All the full the, fat cokes the, we talked about. That Wancy Wendy just didn't think we needed. True. You know, mm. yeah, so not, so watch like that. our video from last week if Do you it. want to know more. Mm. So I had a friend, right? Yeah. Who, he wasn't much of a reader, but he knew it was good for him. Okay. So his bookmark was a fiver. And then ah. when he got to the end, he could celebrate and go and spend his fiver on whatever he wanted. That's a really cool yeah, idea. It's cool I idea, like isn't that. it? Yeah. It's good. Oh, okay. Yeah, well, whatever you do, remember to celebrate at the end of your 30 day challenge. In fact, actually, top tip here, a little bit of a, a bonus, may, maybe make a chart and tick off as you go, because then you've got a visible thing that you can see and you'll be like, oh, oh, I'm doing well. Oh, I'm halfway there. Oh, I'm, I'm getting further and further and further. Ah! And then you'll be like, I'm there. Like that. That's the one. Mm. Tip number five. 
five is make it enjoyable. Oh, make it enjoyable. That's yeah. cool. Yeah. Obviously, like, you want to do something that's enjoyable. Exactly. Like, you don't want to just punish yourself no. for 30 days, do you? No, mm. not really. If you, if you like doing something, then you're more likely to actually do it, right? Speaking of liking, why don't you, if you haven't already, if you've got this far and enjoy this video, why don't you let us know by clicking that little like button. Like, 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 like. Anyway, yeah. Pick something that you like. Pick something that's enjoyable, that's mm. fun, because you'll be excited to get out and do it. Yeah. You know? Yeah, what do you enjoy doing, Hetty? Uh, I quite enjoy playing football, actually. Oh, so you could do like a keep you up challenge every day? Or... I could do that. Oh, yeah, I actually could. could. I didn't even thought about that. Well, I might some, do that. some people might like baking. Baking. Ba ba baking. Baking. True. Like you could you could like bake cake every day or yeah. something like that. And you give it to it? someone else. Ah, like that your, would be good like, for somebody else. Yeah, like your sister in law, yeah. she does that. She, she bakes does. a cake every week and then like, puts it on social media. Yeah. She's like, I made a cake, anyone want a cake? And people are like, Me, me, me that's so me, delicious. I want a cake. Yeah. yeah. I love a cake. I'd love it if somebody yeah. baked a cake for me and was yeah. like, here's a cake. Be like, so do that for someone else. That'd yeah. be pretty cool. If you do it for Hetty or me, yeah, don't ask, do it. Ask us about our dietary requirements. Yeah, we've got loads of issues, so it's hard life. It's tough life. You have been watching this so far, but now is the moment, now is the time to hear what Hetty and Tabs' 30 day challenge actually is. So it's time for the big reveal. Ooh, the big reveal. What, what are we, we going to do? What are we going to do? What are we, we going to do? We are going to, for 30 days, do the 30 day song challenge. Yay! Because... Because? Because, 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 because of the wonderful things he does. Da, 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 da. No, I'm just, you might get that, you might not. It is a song. Yeah. Yeah, because it's big on Instagram at it the is. moment. And we it thought, is. actually, that'd be a cool thing to do to yeah. share something positive every day. And we like music. We do. I actually find music something that really helps me to mm -hmm. express myself and helps me to. Um, like relax as well. So actually, having a bit of focus on some music every day mm. is really quite helpful. I think that is that's my why. That's yeah. my why. Your why. How are the we going to do it though? How is it doable? So every day we're going to post on Instagram, mm. and you're going to see what the challenge is for that day, what song we have chosen, and. We'll give you a little snippet of the song that we have prepared we have. for you. Mm. We will prepare it yeah. in, in a way that you will least mm. expect. Shall we give him a little preview? Yeah, go on then. There you go. Stand under my umbrella, Ella, Ella, eh, 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 under my. Uh, no, you can't stand under my umbrella because uh, Boris says so. You gotta stay two meters apart, so you'll have to get wet. <laughs> So that's our 30 day challenge, the 30 day song challenge. And we're gonna have fun with that, I think, Hattie. I think we will. Um, if you have had fun today with us, do remember to uh, let us know by liking and maybe even drop a comment again to let us know what 30 day challenge you might be considering doing. And if you've enjoyed this, if you found this video helpful, a bit of fun, and you'd like something a bit like this every week, do remember to subscribe um, if you think this is something valuable to you. Okay, get over to Instagram if you're on there. Otherwise, we'll see you with our next lockdown session video sometime next week. Bye! Bye. Bye.